Hi, Mamas. I'm Maggie Shaw, a team member here at Bojen. Welcome to Express Yourself, the YouTube channel where we share tips, tricks, and all things helpful on your mommying journey. In this short video, we're going to talk about clogged milk ducts, what they are, and what you can try to do about them. Now, if you've been experiencing any kind of pain in your breast for any length of time, if you've tried a few different things and it's not working, please, 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 please contact your healthcare provider and talk to them. There's a series of questions that they're going to ask you and they can determine whether it is in fact a clogged duct, whether it's something worse like mastitis, and whether you need to seek medical treatment. This video is just for educational purposes and we hope that it provides you with information that you can use to talk to a lactation professional or your medic medical professional if in fact it gets to that point. So thank you for watching and let's start the video. For breastfeeding and pumping moms, breast pain is no joke and it can have a couple of different causes, but one of the most common ones is from a clogged duct. Now, when we think of our breasts, I think most of us or many of us have a very limited understanding of the actual anatomy within our breast tissue. So if you're like me, you know, okay, look, I've got breasts, I've got nipples, I've got my areola, and I know inside of my breasts there are mammary glands and they're going to be where my baby's milk is stored. When we talk about a clogged duct, we're actually talking about two parts of your breast anatomy. So there is the mammary gland, which we often think about when we think of lactating moms and milk production and breastfeeding or pumping for babies. But then there's actually a lactiferous uh, duct, a lactiferous duct, and that's what is often getting clogged. So it's the gland and then the duct that allows the milk to pass through and to, onto either your baby or uh, whether you're pumping. So what can you do when you get a clogged duct? So the first thing is really to just kind of identify the spot. So where are you feeling the pain? Are you feeling any warmth there? Can you feel any kind of stiffness in your breast tissue? Do you feel maybe a little bit of a harder lump than normal? The first thing you want to do is to continue trying to nurse your baby and or pump. If you stop either of these, you can actually make the problem and then the pain become worse. So you want to make sure that I know even if it's painful, you try to work through that pain and continue to express milk so that you don't become engorged and you don't exacerbate the problem. The next thing you can do is start to incorporate gentle massage. So work not just at the area or the source of that pain, but move around your breast tissue and just try to encourage things to keep moving. And then you might actually be able to open up that clog and remove uh, that source of pain, uh, warmth, or soreness. If nursing as normal, if you're nursing your baby and it's not seeming to alleviate the pain, try a different position. Um, just switching things up can sometimes help encourage milk to flow better. Let's say, you know, if you're normally doing it in a sitting position, try lying on your side or in a reclined position. Um, some moms also will try dangle feeding, which is like being laying your baby down being over top of your baby. They say gravity seems to help working sometimes, help it work through sometimes. Also, you it's a good idea to take stock of the clothing that you're wearing. If you're wearing a lot of restrictive clothing, bras with underwires that are too tight, or if you're wearing really tight sports bras or clothing with tight built-in support, that restrictive clothing can sometimes also be the source of clogged ducts and just sometimes uh, removing the source can help to allow the milk to flow. Uh, if you can and you're at home, try going around without any kind of bra. Our last suggestion is trying gentle heat. So you can hop in the shower. Um, I love to go in the shower and then also incorporate a hot, moist heat with gentle breast massage. You can try certain heat uh, products. So Lilimer makes pads that you can put in the microwave and then use there's also a little bit of added weight to them so there some moms find that to be very helpful uh lilu has gentle warming massagers that moms some moms swear by so try gentle heat in on top of the gentle massage trying different positions and then also not wearing the restrictive clothing 
Now, if the pain persists, if it's in any way severe, even if it's, you know, just for, if it's an immediate thing, you're not trying to, you haven't tried to work through it for days, please, please, please call a lactation professional or your medical professional because it could be a sign that something is wrong. If you are a pumping mom and you are trying to pump through this pain, but the pain that becomes uh, too much, we also suggest that you try our breast pump cushions. Now, we won't help alleviate clogs, but the cushions do provide comfort at the pump, removing the source of friction between your sensitive skin and that hard plastic flange. And they also help many moms get a better fit. So sometimes um, when it comes to pumping, we've talked about nursing, but sometimes when it comes to pumping, not having an accurate fit can cause problems like clog sacks because you're not able to empty out your breasts fully. So if, you're not, if you feel like this is something that might be going on, you've got questions on sizing, you're more than welcome. In fact, we encourage you to reach out to our mommy care team using the email address pump at bogen.com. Thank you so much for watching this short video, moms. I hope that answered some of your questions or at least provided some new information on clogged ducts and what you can try to do about them at home and when to seek actual <laughs> trained medical assistance. Thanks so much for watching, Mamas, and stay pumped for Bojan.